the other Spider-Man's got this. Updates on the trial of the century, the people of New York versus Norman Osborne. You remember Devil's Breath, how Mayor Norman was indirectly responsible for poisoning the city a couple years back? Well, his lawyers have slowed the march of justice down yet again with more delays. Our source inside the courtroom tells me they're bringing frivolous motions to prolong discovery. <sighs> All love to my legal eagle friends, but some days you just gotta say it. Screw you, lawyers. All right, see you next time, kids. This is always a handy place to change. This will make such a difference for the community. Thank you so much for your support. Okay, bye-bye. Miles. Hey, Ma. Mm. Ben, siéntate. <laughs> I just wanted to check in. See how you're doing. Todo bien? Mm. Fine. 
Everything's good. <sighs> okay. It's just a lot right now. So much to take care of in the city. <sighs> Super stressed about my college essay. Pete's busy doing other stuff. And Lee. Lee's still out there. Doesn't that bother you? Of course it bothers me. But I'm committed to making this community better. I've got to let go of things that don't serve me and focus on where I want to go, not where I've been. ¿Entiendes lo que te digo? Yeah. But Lee? I can't just let him go. Angela, I'm gonna have to call you back. No, how could you be locked out? You have a key. Oh. No, no, I, I understand the urgency. Uh, let me make some calls. Okay. Mom, do you need me to go? Didn't you just finish telling me how busy you are? Yeah, but I always have time for my community. Okay, Ma, where am I headed? Harlem Cultural Center, 116th and Convent. That was my friend Angela on the phone. She's the curator, and she's trying to give a prospective donor a private tour. But the security system locked her out. Whoops! Awkward! Angela lined up a bunch of items for a new music exhibit, but funding fell through. And if this donor doesn't cover the costs, the museum might have to close. I'll make sure they get in. I'm passionate about preserving the musical heritage of this community. But how can I donate to a museum where the security system isn't even functional? Darren, I hear your concerns, but I assure you this museum will be... Spider-Man. Oh, thank God. The system's locked us out and it's not responding to any input at all. Let's see if I can figure out what's wrong with it. Need to find the control panel. Control panel. Relays are overloaded. Gotta get inside the walls to fix them. Let's patch things up so Angela can give that tour. Who are these guys? Should the alarm go off? The MP took out the whole system. The alarm will so that's how Angela got locked out. We set the system so I can get in there and stop this guy. Hmm, not too bad. Uh, let me fix it up real quick. Got it. But the system's still down. Gotta find the other relay boxes. Hey, Miles. I checked in with all the feast shelters. No one has seen Martin Lee. <sighs> Thanks. Can't believe I let him get away when I could've... You know? Could've what? Made sure he didn't hurt anyone else. Right. Well, don't worry. I'll keep looking. Keep following that wiring. There must be some valuable stuff in here. These guys seem like pros. With this 
back online. Nice. But the system's still down. Must be more relays. Vax and Drum are already in the truck, right? Yeah. But we got time. And a lot more room in the trucks. Gotta get past these guys without being spotted. How about a distraction in the key of C? What's that? Shoot it! You could do this. Another vent above that guy. How do I get this guy away from the mirror? Better be you! Miles, everything okay? I ran into a snag, but I'm handling it. While you're there, check out some of the instruments. Get you ready for college. Ma, I'm going into music tech. Computers are my instruments. Music starts with a human, their instrument and their soul. When you're mixing or sampling, you have to listen close and capture that soul. Computers can't do that. You know how old you sound right now? Old and wise, you mean? <laughs> That's cool. Stronger signal now. Looks like there's one more relay to bring back online. Oh man. Gotta get all the way across the room. How much time we got? A couple minutes. Drop the last few things and get ready to load them into the trucks. Copy that. Who did that? Who's playing? 
playing music. Gotta get this last relay online, then head to the loading dock. Someone's bumping into things. Nice work, Spatterbot. Now it's my turn. Spider-Man, the front door's finally open. But there is a bunch of stuff missing. It's all up back in the loading docks. And I'll make sure it stays there. Let's get out of here, quick! Yeah. Boss said this would be an yeah. out job. Now Spider-Man's here! Whatever! Take yeah. him off! Yeah. And tell your boss, don't go messing with my neighborhood! Stop dropping weight! Don't let him get your weapon! Grab this, Spider-Man! He's got something! Hold him here. Meet at the rendezvous point in an hour. Not today. We gotta stop those trucks. Funky drummer. They only recovered items from one truck? What a mess. Sorry, Angela. This is a deal breaker. There goes our best hope for a big donor. There's still the fundraising gala. If we don't find that second truck, there is no exhibit. Without an exhibit, there is no gala. Without a gala, the museum will have to close. That won't happen, I promise. Here. belonged to Clyde Stubblefield. Ooh, the original funky drummer. <laughs> Do you know how often his rhythms were sampled? <gasps> he was so influential, a direct line from funk to hip hop. <laughs> Thank you. And don't worry, I'll find the rest of those items. Thank you. Should check in with Pete. Hey, 
Hey, bro, you have a sec? Of course. Uh... Actually, Harry's calling. I have to take this. Catch up later? Oh. Uh, sure, man. Later. Hey, Pete. I'm at EMF. No sign of Doc Connors yet, but I could use an extra set of eyes. On my way. Have you heard anything from MJ? You said she's stopping by his house, right? Nothing yet. She told me she'd call when she got there. Let's hope he's just taking a sick day. Yeah, definitely. I'm gonna check her office. Just come by when you can. special episode for you today. Here to dish about all things going on in Harlem recently is the incredible and brilliant Councilwoman Rio Morales. Good to have you back, Rio. Good to be back, Danica. So, we've been seeing reports of an attempted robbery in Harlem? Unfortunately. But the Harlem Cultural Center is home to artifacts from resilient musicians of color. What better way to honor them than to be equally resilient? We'll recover just fine. If there's one thing I love, it's optimism. And I heard Spider-Man might have been involved. What can I say? Art thieves never expect a fake out. Or Spider-Man. You'd think they'd learn to plan for both. <laughs> right? So Spider-Man was on the scene. That's great. Think he's handsome under that mask? That's what they say. Well, New York wouldn't be the same without him. Thanks, Rio. Give it up for Rio Morales, who graciously lent us her time. Any advice for our audience before we head out? If you need help, ask for it. No one important will judge you. Promise. Oh, I couldn't have said it better myself. Danic out! Not bad. My best friend's kid painted this. I remember her showing me a sketch of it the day before it went up. New York is nothing without its people. here at night that should work for Robbie Is that a good photo spider-man <laughs> the spider-man aren't the only superheroes in New York getting students to class on time one of the greatest powers I've ever seen Everywhere! 
You guys should really leave and go somewhere more tropical! Probably check out that crystal now. It's my turn to follow them. Figure out who they are. I end up at this abandoned school in Harlem. And I'm already beginning to regret this. Marco must have ended up at one of Craven's bases. Poor guy didn't know what he was walking into. Sand crystal. More Marco memories scattered all over New York. Does anyone have sunscreen? And will one of you do my back, please? They won't give up! Crystal time. I find them, and they're waiting for me, with all sorts of weapons. What the hell have I walked into? No wonder he got scared. Craven's tech is no joke.
an hourglass or something! We gotta get that sand crystal! into their trap. But wait, Kimia's his kid? How did I not know about this? Just check back in on Marco. He's steadily improving, making more and more sense. He's even eating again. Doctors are hopeful. Good work. Sand crystal? These things are everywhere. <laughs> you can hear me, Marco. Not interested in a puppet show. <laughs> Sandman for his daughter. And Craven forced it out of him for a stupid hunt.
On the other side of the freezer, I was falling again, but through like the air. All of a sudden, I was not where I was. I was falling up. I was going down. I was coming sideways. How does it look? Was that good? If it's great. <laughs> the bodega beef. It was already a rivalry for the ages when it was just David versus Goliath. But when Tails had to deal with the bodega copying his success by using the exact same mascot, it stepped up to a whole nother level. been there in years. When we were at the Bugle's old office, we'd hide out here whenever Jonah was about to blow. <laughs> and I finished a lot of assignments sitting at that bar and a lot of grasshoppers. <laughs> on my way? Uh, sorry guys, but I'm not leaving without that sand crystal. Marco, what's going on in that head of yours? I tell them to leave us alone, but they don't care. They shoot me with a net, try to hold me down. And I was sand before I knew it. I'm so ashamed, but I had no choice. I gotta get back to you. Marco had to do something. Or else he'd be just like Scorpion right now.
Jersey's Thomas. Home to New York's finest Thomas. Was that a good photo? Post it online! Ah, here we go. Now, I'll admit, I first walked into his shop because of all the articles about his new flavors, but his traditional ones would have kept me coming back. Sometimes a classic is a classic for a reason. <laughs>